good morning. Uh, just landed down in Lincoln, 7 a.m. Set off about 5 ish. Uh, yeah, we're more or less done. I think we're up and might be done today. Yeah. Morning, buddy, about 13 oh, sections to do down this here. And then, and then we've just got to extend these gates with some bits that are there. So that, that goes well. So yeah, we'll get loaded up and we'll keep informed. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it, we are done uh, from the whole perimeter of this skull and um, we've just put these well, I've got these gate extensions on here they actually we've been dreading that but they actually went on really really easy we'll just give it a clean before we go but they went on quite easy I mean they can get over there if they want to but you know um, really don't want to build something up there but yeah, we are done. Uh, it's been a good one. We're probably around you know, two and a half weeks. So we've done it three days ahead of schedule. Not bad at all, really. I think there were 350 something meters. Um, obviously we were meant to do a gate as well, but we uh, made the gate wrong size, didn't they? So some of their own lads are coming to do that on um, I think he said Thursday or Friday this week for kids come back next week. We've done this stretch today from I think we started about here actually. Well it was there, because we had that panel out passing stuff through. And then we've we've come all the way down here. That looks very good. And we even put the uh, street sign back on there, look. Jasmine Rod. So yeah, no complaints there. Yeah. So yeah, there. we were struggling with bolts and nuts actually and we got a courier sent it to us and then we finished it up to there. That's all done. So let's go here. Lancaster at Lincoln. The one in the bag for Airdale. Uh, and yes, uh, we'll uh, go and enjoy a well-earned pint and some to eat. <laughs> we ain't even had any dinner, we'll just start sod it today. We'll stay and get it done. No point stopping. So we're all a bit uh, hungry and thirsty. Where that gate went, just a bit of concrete in uh, where the path where the, we took the old post out. Apart from that, 10 minutes will we'll, we'll be done probably leave us stuff here and his van and uh, we'll be staying over tonight obviously it's not going a bit now and then uh, we'll get them in the morning and uh, that's it so yeah all in all good job and we'll see you later good morning Oof, I haven't, I haven't done much filming the last couple of days so loads of admin and quotes and everything so I've been in office Literally day and a half, non-stop. Um, lads are over in uh, Home Firth today doing a little job, talking about doing their quotes. And <laughs> I didn't actually realise I'd just come and see a little job to want to get here. I actually did all this fencing all the way around the school years ago. Um, <laughs> it's strange how you forget to do that many. I probably did this eight, ten years ago, something like that, I think. Uh, yeah, I did loads around the other side, the big field around the back of here. Yeah, I did all this. <laughs> I am good! <laughs> Strange when you look back, really. But yeah, anyway, I'll uh, I'll go see what they want and I'll get back to you. Meanwhile... Right, so we've just finished here 
in uh, BD4, looking good, nice bin store for him and we blocked the entrance. What are you doing? So this is a 1.2 gate here, opening out. Jamie's just putting last post on the wall and uh, goes around. All tarmac up. Both gates opening beautifully, all pinned back. And then coming around the side here and just block that bit up as well so no one can get around. So yeah, it's looking good. Hello there, right here already. I'm just uh, with Matt here, we're just doing a bit of survey at Betfoot Grammar. Um, what it is, is we're actually doing a, a sliding gate on Tuesday next week after Van Collier. By the entrance over there, replacing an existing one with a new one manual. And we just happened to call in, but if you remember, we actually recladded these gates a while ago when we did some fence on the roof. And basically this doesn't slide very cracking on the roller. It's kind of identified why. Well, a couple of issues, I think. One, it's not quite sitting level in the roller but then it's actually worn the roller away that's obviously meant to be round it's gone square there look you can see it look. Well, it should be like that one um, and then there's all the running gear underneath not right cracking and then this one's a bit similar that's actually leaning the other way so it's like the gates are twisted and then this locking bar is actually not straight, so there's a few issues. And it's, and it's just that's just to have a look while we're here, so if, you know, if we can grease them, do whatever. Um, so yeah, we'll we'll get this one sussed out and we'll let him know what it needs. So yeah, that's us uh, more or less done another week. I've just been out doing some surveys with Matt on some sliding gates and whatnot. Um, yeah, it's all uh, looking good. This side of things, the WSCs coming on good, uh, you've got some good uh, works in the pipeline and quite, and quite a few, they all come off and yeah, it's all good in the hood. Um, as for Airedale, yeah, we're doing doing good, we're sort of booked up for four to six weeks I believe now, so yeah, no, not bad at all, after the, more or less get the last few schools out of the way next week, um, and then well, obviously we're still doing schools but not in the mad six week holiday rushes normally happens every year just back to normal steady away sort of carry on how we like it so yeah i'll uh, sign out here um if you haven't already done so give us a like give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you, you haven't already and um, we'll see you next week thank you we've got baggy in pants that's where he's been all day the old team's here today even our electric guys are here look at that the eagle has landed. <laughs>